The students here at the Pulaski County Special School District, as you can see, have a lot more to choose from this year than they have in years past. And the Arkansas Food Bank says this is a big step in the right direction as they continue to combat food insecurity in Arkansas. How are you doing today? Good. Nacho or taco? Options beyond options. I've seen improvement already. I've been here for like four years now. Students at PCSSD can choose from tacos, nachos, pizza, fresh fruit and vegetables, salads, wraps, sandwiches. The menu goes on. We do try to provide as many options as possible to make sure that they have the proper nourishment. The extension of free meals for all students and a larger variety of food is opening doors for a lot of children to access school meals. The Arkansas Food Bank says this is crucial as the organization works to combat child hunger statewide. Unfortunately, we see a lot of kids when they're coming back into the classroom that their counselors or their teachers are actually noticing that they've lost weight over the summer um, because they've lost access to those consistent meals. A goal at PCSSD is to increase mill counts. On Wednesday at Mills High, the school served 237 mills with just over 600 students enrolled there. The district believes if students are satisfied in the cafeteria, it could also improve test scores. It's going to be a happy environment in the classrooms, happy environment all over our campuses. While districts tackle hunger at school, the Arkansas Food Bank says the work doesn't stop there. The need is far greater. They are working to expand the backpack program, which would feed more hungry children during the weekends. Our backpack program is in such high demand across our entire service area that we keep a wait list year round for schools that have a need in their community. Jordan Howington, THV 11 News.